ESPN is brought to you by Hampton Hotels. It is standing room only at Mountaineer Field on a cold Saturday night for one of the hottest rivalries in all of college football. Welcome back to Morgantown. They have been playing this series since 1895. Pitt with an overwhelming advantage. But in the last 15 meetings, West Virginia has dominated. And the Mountaineers won last year, rolling up a lot. Evans out of the Northeast at six with the light rain. We are expecting freezing rain and sleep later this evening. Pitt will get the ball first. Robinson on the return. Across the 25, 30, fighting for extra yardage, goes down at the 33. It, Pat Bostic, one of three freshman quarterbacks starting in the country, hands it off to McCoy, makes a nice move on the corner, faked out Antonio Lewis and picked up a couple of more yards to possess the ball. McCoy is the deep man in the eye, and Bostic is going to throw. Loops it downfield, and it's picked off by Antonio Lewis. The pass underthrown, and Lewis has a convoy. Midfield, 40, 30, and out of bounds at the pit 29-yard line. Cedric McGee made the tackle of 47 yards. 27, Pat White with Slayton and Devine split. And Noel Devine, the diminutive freshman, will get the first carry. To tell us about the Mountaineer offense, here's George St. Pete. And they put so much pressure on you in space that if you don't tackle well, you get gashed very easily. Schmidt is now in there with Slayton in the backfield. White on the keeper to Schmidt. The big guy to the 10. First down, West Virginia. They broke that tendency. We saw them. Third and goal. White wants to throw. There's that quick little spin. Schmidt trying to throw the block on the corner. Really nice play defensively by Jameel Brady, number sure 24. Well, so the kick from this angle. He missed it. And McAfee wide left. I think that got in his head a little bit. You know, they call timeout or they try to take the penalty. They try to, to get a better angle. That's in his head. He hasn't missed for the national championship. Mountaineers showing blitz. And here they come. They don't get there. Now they do in Boston. We'll go down at the 22-yard line. They have done such a better job this year. Hang up. And Randy Etzel, their coach, said if they don't turn it over, nobody beats them. They win the national championship. White in trouble. Runs away from it. Pat White with that blazing speed. Everybody had an angle on him, and he still destroyed him. And Rich said they had to re-recruit him again to kind of sell him on coming to West Virginia to play football. Schmidt trying to get the first down. This is going to be very close to the sticks. And he wasn't one of those guys who was a 51st round draft choice either. He they had at least a shot. Well, Holly, it's almost a lost start against anybody, let alone a team with this kind of speed. They can make you look silly even when you're in the right place. White wow. with a he gun and shot? Renaud fell down trying to stop. And McAfee will try from 32. He missed a chip shot from 20. My gosh, he missed another one. Are you kidding? McAfee had missed only third down here. Pitt just wants to string some first downs together. Ouch. <laughs> well, West Virginia and Jeff Castillo. Feet are okay, right? <laughs> first and ten from the 45. White hit from behind. The ball is loose, and the Panthers have it. Yep. Well, we talked about turnovers. Now, again, this was ruled a fumble, which means they can review it. If it would have been ruled an incomplete pass. Now they've got three wide receivers in there on third and seven. West Virginia comes with another blitz. Bostic somehow got away from it. Throws on the run, and it's uh. intercepted. Yes. <laughs> I know Bostic is not the motion threat. Is just the same going left or right with those two guys. Schmidt back in the game now. They go to Slayton. Made a move to get free, and then Slayton shows you a little power. He was trapped. That play was going yep. absolutely nowhere. Eyes Brandon Hogan, another freshman receiver that's getting more play time. White 
designated quarterback run and gets maybe a yard out of it, and that's it. Well, I'll tell you what, Pat White is down at the uh -oh. end of that play. The only game they lost this year, Pat White. Brown, who played extensively in the South Florida loss, takes off. Brown, first down, out of bounds at the 33-yard line. Obviously, Pitt comes with a blitz. Brown on a rush, throws Raynaud. Horse collared out of bounds at the 10. Kid's got a nice pair of hands, doesn't he? It's a little stronger than that. Yeah, just a little. What a mistake. Touchdown, West Virginia. Instead of forcing a field goal, and they've already missed two, right. it's a touchdown. And you made the point earlier, you can't give a team like this too many chances. And uh, Pitt has played well, but they kept giving West Virginia chances. And that time, the offense led by 43 to go in the half. West Virginia gets a touchdown and gets on the board. It's not an easy block for a center. Mike Dent did it beautifully that time. McCoy. Out to the 46. Panthers now on second and a long two. Line up to throw. They throw underneath. And Turner makes the catch. Oh, late flat four. And Lee drills it. Panthers will grab a little momentum going. West Virginia is going to be in the hands of Jarrett Brown, his backup. Vaughn Rivers. That's it. From behind, ball comes loose. Did Pitt get it? Yep, yes, they, they did. did. Holy cow. Well, we said, what does Pitt have to do to have a chance to win this game? They have to. They're in field goal territory. Bostic, short set, can't find anybody. Now throws underneath, and that's going to be short of yeah. the first down. It looked like Porter, if he makes the catch and turns to his left, he's got the first down, but he came back and lost at least else with our offense. Good point as well. Now Rivers, who would just love to make up for that mistake, waits back at his 10. Oh, fake punt. I love it. I love the call. And it worked. I, I thought that they were going to go for it, but that was a that was an execute. They're throwing the football here. Will West Virginia bring pressure on this third and long? Bostic out of the shotgun. Four-man rush. Throws to the sideline, and it's caught for a first down at the 17 by O'Derek Turner. McCoy. First down inside the five to the four. Nice, hard run. That was a big-time run. Running behind the fullback, Panthers as well. Second and goal. Quarterback keeper, Bostic. Touchdown. <laughs> Lost his helmet, but got the ball across the plane. He doesn't care. No. They'll get him another helmet. Boy, made a big-time throw in this drill of other places. Pitt has taken the lead in the rest of this football game. Third and long, Brown. That's an incomplete pass. The arm was coming forward. Brown. The official finally, the umpire finally said, playing as well as they are, don't give West Virginia an opportunity by being careless with the football. How about a screen that worked beautifully earlier? Little shovel pass to McCoy. He's hit and dropped, but should have the first down. And it wasn't McCoy, excuse me, it was uh, Stevens. Celebrating prematurely or anything, but it hasn't shown tonight in the ballgame. McCoy, first down and more. McCoy inside the 30 to the 28-yard line. And once again, it was C.J. Davis throwing the big block that sprung him into the second.
fullback. About a half yard shy. Boy, just. They'll give it to Collins, the fullback, and he dives and has the first down. Condridge Collins, and West Virginia did a good job of Terry Turner. An enormous break for West Virginia. Pitt pushed all the way back to the 18. Now they throw the screen, and he gets nothing. Daryl Strong is huge. Connor Lee from 35. He missed it. Holy cow. Two of the most reliable field goal kickers in this country by the Panthers, who right now want it more than they do. Blitz coming on Brown. They pick it up, and Brown down the middle. Renaud had two steps on his defender in the ball. I'd say be alert for a screen here if I'm West Virginia. It worked in the first half. Bostic straight down the middle. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> Looked like it was going to be intercepted by Johnny. Third and seven. They need to reach the 35. Blitz coming. Little flanker screen. And they'll lose three. Trying to get it out to Stevens Howling in the flat. But again, the fact running lanes against this pit defense tonight. Got enough for the first down. Brown. Fumble, that's a fumble. Lost the ball. That's a fumble. Pitt has it. And how appropriate. Tommy Duhart, who got called for the costly yeah. penalty in the first half that set up a West Virginia touchdown. Tackle in as the up back. 70, Dominic Williams. McCoy behind him. McCoy. Turn back at the one. Pat Lazier, this would mean West Virginia would need a touchdown. And that's exactly what it means. The Panthers have delivered, but West Virginia's still alive with that. Is he taking snaps under the center with the bad thumb? They've been in the shotgun every snap tonight. Todd, I think he wanted to see if he could withstand the pain of the thumb getting hit. Noel Devine stops. Oh. If he says he's good. White on second and 10. Gives it to Slayton. Slayton picks his way to the 20. His favorite receiver. White goes in that direction. Diving forward. It's going to be fourth and about three. Well, here's the decision. You've already had your clutch field goal kickers. Are... The national championship might hinge on this play. Slayton, he didn't get it. Oh, he did. He wasn't even close. McKillop was there to make a tackle. Sort of an odd call, don't you think? So now it's third and very long. Bostic, way too high, and Turner wanted a holding call. And not only was it way too high, but it was incomplete, which stops the clock. So West. The 100th edition of the Backyard Brawl is as good as any they've ever played. Raynaud open. Darius Raynaud to the pit 33. First down, West Virginia. That's legend at West Virginia. McKillop edges up as a middle linebacker. White takes off. Blockers in front. First down at the 21-yard line. You don't think this guy is tough? At 185 pounds with a dislocate. Looks like they'll come with three. Now they show blitz and come. White lost the ball. Knocked down and tackled. This will be fourth and long. The blitz didn't get there, but he was certainly distressed. The fumble might have been the, the most costly of the night. Mountaineers have to reach the 11 for a first down. White throws it up. Incomplete pass, trying to get it up high for Wes Lyons, the big rangy wide receiver. McCoy stacked up. Now when they mark the ball. And then just run around. That's, That's what they're going to do. Yep. Smart play. Just run the clock. Don't run out of the end zone. Over. The Pitt Panthers 
Tigers have pulled a stunning upset over the West Virginia Mountaineers and just denied them a place in a national championship game. The last time they did this, beat a number two team, was when they knocked off Georgia in the 82 Sugar Bowl. A huge win for Dave Wanstatt that is going to send 60,000-plus home not believing what they just saw.